More than 150 moons circle the planets of our solar system, and among them, one is closer to us than any other, Earth's moon. Scientists estimate the moon formed around 4.5 billion years ago. According to one popular theory, a young Earth collided with another early planet. The impact threw debris into space, which eventually came together to form the moon we know today. It is the fifth largest natural satellite in the solar system, about as wide as China. At its core lies iron surrounded by a mantle and crust made of minerals containing magnesium, oxygen, and silicon. Billions of years ago, the moon's surface was alive with geological activity and even covered by molten rock. Today it's quiet, a barren, rocky world coated in dust, scattered debris, and small traces of frozen water. Craters cover nearly every part of the moon, formed by countless meteoroids, comets, and asteroids. The largest, the South Pole Aitken Basin, spans a quarter of the surface and is so deep Mount Everest could nearly fit inside. The moon orbits Earth at an average distance of about 30 Earths placed side by side. Because it rotates at the same rate it circles Earth, we always see the same face. For thousands of years, people observed its eight lunar phases, which helped shape early calendars. Then on July 20th, 1969, humans set foot on the moon for the first time with NASA's Apollo 11 mission, bringing us closer than ever to understanding Earth's only natural satellite. 